Okay. So I guess something cool is happening. That's what I guess you could say. Time yeah. meatballs. Time meatballs, With huh? Time from the garden. Organic. From the garden? Oh yeah, from the garden out here. There's Livy with her donut on. And there from outside in the garden. We got time. And we got some rice over there. And we're just cooking. You know, it's not not too crazy, but it's what we're doing in quarantine. We're cooking and doing family stuff. So it's glad to see that happening. We've kind of jerry rigged everything here. Um that's our old TV. But uh my brother brought back his big ass desktop. And uh you know, we've managed to attach, that's off, but it's double monitor technically, that's why there's no sound right now, because the sound comes out of the TV, but, yeah, so, we've managed to move our entire house around, there's my foot, I'm so sorry, everyone had to see that, but, uh, yeah, a little bit of a house tour, huh? <laughs> I don't know if you can see it, but here I am outside, my little man bun, I see a lizard, can I see the lizard? <gasps> you can't zoom in this, but it's a lizard right there, it's pretty cool. And here I am throwing the ball for my dog. Say hi, Freya. Yeah, that's her. So, uh, I don't know if I'm gonna get copyrighted. I don't know how that works. I'm not a YouTuber, but. Um, we are listening to Crazy Frog uh, while making lots of cookies. And uh, I have a man bun, so that's new. Is this a mix of the hamster dance? I have no idea what you're saying. And my sister's over there uh, cooking as well. It's a mix of the hamster dance. Okay, hey guys. So uh, this is like the last part, I guess, of my vlog. I thought, oh my god, the angle. Anyway, <laughs> I, I thought I'd, um, you know, I'm really into languages and I, and I want to learn all the romance languages and I want my channel to be about, you know, uh, fun languages. So I figured I would go through um, and have, I guess, have the end of each of my vlogs dedicated to like language progress and, and you know what I'm doing um, to learn the language that I want to. So I figure I'll have to set you guys down here. Um, oh my god. I don't know about this y'all. I don't know about this at all. Oh my god. Okay, <laughs> I'll find a better angle and then I'll show you guys what I'm doing. Yeah, okay. I think this works. It's not a great angle for me. There's a second chin right there, but I uh, I want to go and talk about so my goals now. I I have a paper down here, a notebook that I like to that I you know I like to have writing all my language notes and everything. So what I specifically did was I went and I I wrote down like a, a sort of a goal journal for for what I want to do and learn. So here I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to see it. Uh, it's gonna be on the opposite side. I'm not sure how to do that in editing yet or switch it. But I have here, you know, Portuguese, Spanish, and French, the languages that I want to learn. And to the side of those languages here, I've written uh, a short goal that I want to focus on during the summer. So for Portuguese, I'd like to increase my vocabulary and then, you know, work on future tense, because I still struggle with that, even though I, you know, speak pretty fluently. Um, Spanish, I definitely want to work on increasing vocab, um, work with direct object pronouns, and then sentence structure, because I end up uh, mixing it up a lot with, with the Portuguese sentence structure, and while they're quite some of the languages, a lot of times they don't exactly end up, oh, well they don't, um, they're not equal when it comes to a uh, sentence and structure. Um, and then for French, I uh, definitely, um, it's a beginner language for me, I, I need to really work on that. So I have here basic vocabulary, pronunciation, and like a two minute convo at the end of the summer that I could be able to do. Um, and so I have written out the days for May, these days I just write down what I do for each language. So, per se, oh, you know, I, uh, I watch some Netflix and YouTube in Portuguese for a little bit. Um, and then, so, for French, what I do to basically learn, I don't know, just basic vocab, is that I have been going through Duolingo, which I think is a great app if you, you know, want to focus on vocab or, like, some words, uh, but not necessarily a great app for essentially learning a language from, from start. But I have gone through uh, Duolingo, and I'm writing down... Um, all the vocab that I learn. And then I go back and I, and I study that. It's just basic vocab, like, you know, like, mine, where, um, there, I go, I take, whatever. So I can use that to, as a basis, or uh, foundation for my next learning language steps. Um, what I also do is I'm really into, I think it's a great way to learn languages is by uh, 
oh my goodness, I forgot the word in English, is basically where I just surround myself with just media in French, um, Spanish and Portuguese, and all the other languages that I want to learn. Um, and so what I specifically do is specifically do is I uh, I watch YouTube videos um, in French. And a lot of times YouTube videos are like I don't really understand what's going on, but I'm able to pick out some certain words, and I'm like, oh my goodness, um, you know, I'm understanding what's going on. So I like to actively listen to a lot of um, French YouTube videos. And then um, I would also recommend what I do for Portuguese is I, I have several textbooks here, um, which are really important for me because I like to learn. Hey, oh my goodness, my dogs are in the back. I'm not gonna go back and edit that, so it's gonna be in there. Um, this is all gonna stay in the video because I'm not gonna edit it out. I'm, I'm too lazy for this. What I was saying is that I'm going to read this out loud. I read it out loud to myself and it's helpful with learning like professional or, or uh, more complicated Portuguese words. Anyway, that's that. Um, if you guys like to see like more language videos, especially like, you know, interesting facts or, or how I specifically learn languages, um, definitely subscribe. Please write me a comment being like, oh, why do you like languages? And I'll be like, they're fun. Um, but other than that, yeah, I think that's the end of my video. It's the end of the vlog. I had a pretty boring vlog. Um, but yeah, please subscribe. I would give me, it's gonna be, definitely would give me validation if you like this video, subscribe. But you don't have to. You can leave a hate comment. I don't care. Um, but thanks, y'all. And I'm um, saying goodbye to my second channel. <laughs> that's it. Just hold it's me. kind of a bot.